Hi guys and welcome back to episode 9 of my Football Manager 2018 series where we're taking fair, th fair warp all the way hopefully to the Premier League. So first things first, today we've got three games, Fairfield 2, Skeens Hill 3 and Ifield Galaxy 2. Two cup games, one league game, so without further ado, there's no other news, let's get into it. So team unchanged um, as per the last game. Taylor and Nets, back four of Hamilton, Sinclair, Bennett and Perry. Midfield, Riviere sitting, uh, Hawkins just in front of him. And then a three in the attacking line is Moore, Hayes and Cobb, all behind Carlito Lawton, who's been on excellent form. Our new signings on the bench again. Um, they've all done well enough to start. However, I just think that um, we could use some stability just now. And uh, without further ado, let's get into the Fairfield 2 game. So we kick off the game in our orange strip. Long ball forward and it's saved by the goalkeeper. Very easy start for them. 21 minutes on the clock. Hamilton with a free kick. It's cleared behind for a corner. The only notable thing that happened so far apart from that free kick was uh, Cobb getting a booking. It's headed away. Here's Cobb on the ball. Long ball forward and it's going to come to nothing. Free kick. Moore with it. Whipped in and a good stop by the keeper. Free kick against Riviere. <sighs> Skims it wide. Free kick to us, ball's in, it's headed clear. And it's back out to Sinclair. Good ball in, header down, a ball in, and Hawkins, good stop by the keeper. We're putting on all the pressure, they've had no shots. We've had about seven, and it's just nil nil still. And very disappointing, to be honest. Lawton with a free kick. Whips it out, goal! What a finish, Carlito Lawton, excellent goal. That will do nicely. On straight through the wall, actually, um, and past the keeper who had no chance. 1 0 with a couple of minutes to go before half time. Free kick. It's a ball in. Here's Lawton, the goal scorer. Tripped again. And Gunn's booked for that one, but Lawton stands over the free kick. He scores from his last one. Ah, well, we talked him into that. They've got a corner kick, and they laugh it wide. And that could be the end of the first half. Try to motivate the lads and let's go for the second half. Fingers crossed more of the same and we can get away from here with a victory. Because our league form has been a little bit inconsistent of late. So I'll be looking to win this game and move on and hopefully, you know, I mean if we can clinch the title sooner rather than later I'd be delighted. Um, obviously we're quite close in at the moment but we're not that many games in this league season. It does make for an interesting time. It's not like it's a 38 game season, it's an 18 game league season. So that always makes it quite good fun. I think we could just use with a wee um, sub a few substitutions here just to kind of brighten up a bit because to be honest, the team, although we're doing okay, um, I think we could really stretch them if we wanted to. Um, so, Chambers in advance forward, Moon as a poacher, as per the last game, and also we'll bring on Granger for Riviere. I think, no, Granger for Hawkins. For the simple reason that I think that you know we could just use that little bit extra um, in that sort of attacking midfield. And I think, you know. With him playing the... Oh, no, maybe not attacking the field. Ignore me. Um, probably on the right-hand side here. Just pull him back. Let's see. See if we can get him in the position I want him. That's it. Move Cobb back there. Just to sit alongside Riviera. In fact, I'll swap them around, actually. Put Cobb, just leave Cobb where he was. Because he was doing well there. And put Granger just sitting there. We put him bombing in the field. It's not maybe his ideal role. And we do have players that could also play that role. But I just feel like we need that little bit more stability in there. If we're going to be playing the two up front. So they've got a throw in. Played forward. Granger picks it up. Good ball. Moore's lost it. And now they could come forward. It's gone. But we intercept ball along to Moon. Moon with the ball in Chambers. And Granger, well over the bar. Disappointing. Well, guys, it's been a nothing second half, which is excellent for me, because it just means that um, we're able to get this victory, hopefully, 
I've got a couple of minutes left to go. Um, just to see this out, I'm delighted with the performance by the lads. Um, they really have shown that you know we can dig in and get the result when we needed. And I think that's it now. Referee puts the whistle to his lips. And hopefully, yes, there we go. 1-0 fair whop. We're winning again in the league. Absolutely delighted. Well done, team. Passionately well done. Good win. Bugger off, team. Don't bother. Who's that switching off? Hamilton. There's a shock. Boys not being um, switched on off fucking season. Um, <clears throat> you know, for one of our better players, he really has disappointed me in his attitude to life. Um, life of this league. Look, you're in this league. Let's get us out of this league. That's the way I see it. Um, let's just all try and do what we can. But Hamilton seems to have this, you know, I don't know, more superior kind of attitude, and I don't like that. I think that although he is a good player, he may well be moving on at the end of the season. Um, not too sure as of yet whether he will or not, but it may be a rebuilding job for that left back position because I'm not having players that, you know, are have got that kind of attitude. Now, all of a sudden, we are five points clear of Stones 2, um, which is good. Um, I mean, obviously, things can happen throughout a season that mean that we, we fall down. But I mean, with 10 games gone, we're five points clear. I'm happy with that. We've not lost a game all season in the league, and long may that continue. Same thing going at the Skins Hill game, guys. We've got Taylor and Nets, back four, Hamilton, Perry, Sinclair, Bennett, midfield, Riviere, Hawkins, Hayes, Moore and Cobb, and Lofton up top. So without further ado, let's get into the game and let's hope we can absolutely hammer them in the first in the next round of the cup. This is the third round of this cup. So let's hope that we can uh, do us do ourselves proud and um, get through in the mid Sussex Junior Cup third round. Oh my god! I didn't call, I didn't comment on that because I thought it was the first highlight. Oh my fucking god, Bennett! What was he doing? That is unbelievable. We're actually one 0 down, guys, in like a minute. What? I, 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 there just are no words to describe how shite that was. Bennett with a terrible back pass, and Taylor just let it go. And at this level, I mean, look at that. They've had no shots, and yet they're one 0 up. That, oh my word. Here they come again. Good tackle there. Here's Hawkins. Booted forward. Here's Cobb on the ball. Running at the defence. Ball into Hayes. Hayes picks it up. Passes to Hawkins. Hayes again. Lawton. Cobb. Hey, Hawkins. It's 1-1. Oh, and the most relieved man in this place is Bennett right now. Um, that because he's just you know been let off the hook for what was the worst own goal I've seen in the, like the last few games. <clears throat> and I'm only saying that because we had one earlier on in the season which was utterly, utterly woeful. Free kick to us, whipped in and headed wide. Free kick to them, ball out wide. They're playing nice intricate passing until we snatch it off them. Move with a long ball forward to Lawton. And Hayes picks it up, and Hayes scores! 2-1, fair warp. Excellent play. Hayes rams it in the bottom corner. 2-1, and that makes me feel a lot, lot better. It's a penalty. Perry shoved their guy. And his Sinclair's been given the yellow card. You know, it said Perry shoved them. And they're going to score this, aren't they? Yep, 2-2, half time. It will be. Going into disappointing, really disappointing. I thought when we went two one up, I thought that's us. You know, we're, we'll we'll kick on from here, but clearly not. Our players had other ideas in mind. Two two half time. So back to the second half. Ball out to Cobb. Cobb on the ball. Ball in. Header from Moore, and it's two one uh, three two. That is excellent. What a start to the second half. Ball out to Cobb. 
great ball in here, and there's Moore at the back post, slotting the ball home, 3 2. Straight from kickoff, that's a worry. Ball forward, and Skilton slams it wide. Corner kick, he's with the corner. Hit in by Sinclair, it's 4 2. Oh, what a header. He just stooped down low, it looked like, and headed the ball home, it's 4 2, and now we can get the subs on. So what I'm going to do here, fairly simple. Again, bring on Chapman for Hayes. I just feel that he could do something here. Um, I'll bring on Moon uh, for Lawton. Change him up to be a poacher. And I think I'll bring on Starkey for Sinclair. After his goal, just give him a wee rest and uh, give Starkey another game. Excellent, though. 4 2. What a second half performance this has been. Corner kick again, and it's it's Starkey. I just put him on one minute ago, and it's five two, and all of a sudden this is looking easy. Then we're gonna throw into Skelton, who's giving it away to Cobb, but we've given it away now. That's not good play from us. Bennett picks it up, long ball looking for Moor or Moon, and Moon is forward, and Moon scores, and that is six two guys. That is impressive. Long ball here from Bennett. English football at its best. And Moon puts the ball past the goalkeeper. Six goals for us. Six different scorers. Perry. Long ball forward. It's a bit scrappy. But hopefully we can come away with this. It's Bennett. Good play to Moore. Long ball looking for Moon. And it's seven. Charlie Moon. Scores a seventh goal for us. That really is crucial. I and mean, I think that this performance alone, we, he should play the next game from the start. Um, but I mean, I kind of like his you know, coming off the bench with all his pace. So I'm not really sure. I mean, Callie's a lot, and I don't think he'd be as, as good off the bench when teams are tiring. I really don't think he'd be as, as good as Moon has. Corner kick, Hawkins. Uh, Chapman, oh, slides it by Connor Moore with it. Riviere, ball back in and Bennett heads it wide. Two minutes out of time and that should be it. Through to the next round of the cup. Comfortably for a fair warp. Excellent news. And so we will get on to it. Just congratulate the guys and go on from here. That's excellent. Okay, guys, just before the cup draws, um, yeah, I said draws, there's two draws, um, just wanted to update you, I've been offered the man, well, there's been a link to the manager's job at Three Bridges, obviously this is a Fair Warp series, I'm not interested in going to anyone else, I'm really happy with being here at Fair Warp, I've dismissed the rumours absolutely out of hand, um, straight into the Brian Hall Challenge Cup quarterfinal, this is the one that we haven't qualified for yet, uh, we've got that game next, but just um, the, the way the draw is, they've done it now, so we'll see who we get, or who we would get, if we win our next game. And it's going to be, it would be at home to West Heathley 2, who, or Hothley 2, who we've got in our league anyway. So not very exciting um, <coughs> quarter, potential quarterfinal draw, but the Mid Sussex Junior Cup quarterfinal draws today. This is one that we have qualified for through the last um, cup game, obviously as we saw. So we'll see who we do get. Please let it be someone different from usual. It's not going to be, is it? It's going to be Crawley United two. We're in our league again. So, obviously they couldn't play at home because Crawley United are actually playing at home. So, that kind of works out quite well for us. A home tie against Crawley United too. Um, really quite happy with that. So, that, that's fine. So, we'll take that and um, move on. So, next game, obviously, is the Brian Hall Cup um, against Ifield Galaxy 2. So, see you guys there. Unsurprisingly, the guys kept the same team as won the last game, 7-2. Uh, Taylor and Nets, back four, Perry, Hamilton, Sinclair and Bennett. 
Midfield, uh, Riviere, Hawkins, Moore, Hayes and Cobb with Lawton up front on his own. On the bench, Starkey, Granger, Chapman, Moon and Chambers. So, uh, Moon, despite having two goals and playing really well in the last game, I just thought, leave him on the bench, see if he can have that impact again. If he does, he may well become a super sub. Without further ado, let's get into them and let's absolutely smash I Feel Galaxy 2 and let's get into the next round, the quarterfinals of the Brian Hall Challenge Cup. So here we go guys, in, the, in blue, I'm coming on the first highlight just because of the last game when I got caught out there and uh, I got sucked in by the, the usual FM first highlight syndrome and uh, never actually commented on the goal. Uh, the <laughs> this stupid on goal that we conceded. Um, it really is ridiculous. I mean, you can imagine if that happened in the Premiership, there'd be questions being asked um, of the, the standard of player that we've got. But we'll, we'll wait and see how this goes. So, ball over the top. It's fizzed about in midfield there. And Cobb picks it up. Crosses in deep. And Lawton scores. Carlito Lawton. Well... I was commenting on why I shouldn't start Charlie Moon. Um, that's a reason. Is that Carlito Lawton in the air is unstoppable. Ball across and headed off the post. A good stop by our goalkeeper. Nick Taylor earning his corn there. And literally at this level it is corn. Perry on the ball. And we've lost it, but can we get it back? We can, you know, Carlito Lawton. Oh, I should have buried that. Should have buried that, Carlito. Moore on a free kick. It's poor. And they've got a chance to break now, but we've picked it up. With Sinclair. Long ball, and Moore doesn't punish them. Really should have done, but couldn't find the finish. There's a wee ball outside to Cobb. Who just loses it tamely. And Gardner comes in. And Gardner strikes at goal but well wide. Gardner with a free kick. It's burning about there and it was close. They're getting closer. And that's a worry for us. Taylor with a kick. Headed down to Hayes. Williams picks it up for them. Perry. A ball over the top. Gardner's on tip. And again, he looks like their danger man. But we mop it up there. It's now Lawton. Into Hayes. Sclaffed it wide. And here comes Gardner. Their danger man scores. I, I, I called that a bit a minute ago. He said he looks like their danger man. And, well, we've been proved right. That was particularly bad. Particularly bad from our defence. We just split apart and let them score. Simple as that. Good tackle there. There's a ball, Lawton. Play it in the middle, play it in the middle, play it in the middle. Oh no, close. Hawkins! Yes! 2 1. Back in it. Oh boy. Well, Lawton, I thought he was going to duff this up here. I thought we'd lost it, but Hawkins, great finish. Here's Hamilton, shocking free kick. Our free kicks have been dreadful, throw in Hamilton. Ball over, Rivera. Oh, off the post from Rivera. Oh, the defensive midfielder whacking it off the post there. That'll be half time, it's 2 1 to Fair Warp. Into the second half now, and here they come forward again. But Hayes picks it up. Ball to Lawton. What can you do? Can you finish? Yes, you can, Carlito Lawton. Makes it three. And that will do nicely. And now, I think, is the time when we can say the game is won. Let's make the changes. It's only 49 minutes on the clock, but let's make the changes anyway. Um, Moon on for Lawton, who's done well. I'm taking him off on a hat trick, so probably he'll be a wee bit disappointed. Bring on Chambers for Hayes, who's played well throughout the season. 
Um, I just think he needs a, a rest every now and again. So Chambers can come in. Play as that advanced forward. And I think probably Chapman as well. On for Hawkins. Just move Chapman up a wee bit. Play as that attacking midfielder. We've got Revere sitting there anyway. So we've got that protection. It's 3-1. We're loving life at the moment. Taylor with a goal kick. Or the long kick. And Tamur. He's lost it. And Gardner's through. And Gardner. Oh we are so lucky. Long ball forward from them. Revere picks it up. Good ball out. To Hamilton. To Moore. To Moon. To Chambers. Back to Moore. Good. Silky play here from us. Really just passing the ball about for fun. And Chambers through. And side netting only. Throw in. Moore. To Revere. Oh he has a post again. Second time in the game that Riviera has hit the post. Unlucky that man. 15 minutes left. As Chambers picks it up and rams it home. Nathan Chambers picks up on a complete fuck up from their defence. They just couldn't hold it and good finish from Chambers. They've got a free kick now. Lloyd. We don't want to concede again. Gardner straight at Taylor. Taylor with the boot up the park to Moore. He's past the defender. And to Chapman. Oh. Just laughed it well wide. It's Cobb. That long ball down the wing doesn't seem to do much for us any time. It's Gardner. I was thinking he was a danger man earlier on when he scored, but that's woeful. To be fair, he has played by far the best in their team. But that looks like being that, guys. As Moor, uh, Moon takes it on, plays, plays in the way for Cobb. Ball in, keeper saves it, and that will be that. Full time, 4 1 fair warp. Fantastic result. Through the next round of the cup, and that is where we want to stay. <laughs> We're going to end the episode there, guys. Uh, it's been three fantastic wins. One against Fairfield 2, one against Skins Hill 3, and one against Ifield Galaxy 2. It's been now 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, yeah, 6 wins on the trot. 7 games without defeat. We can't argue with that. We're top of the league in the Division 9. We're through to the next round. The quarterfinals are both the Sussex Junior Cup, third round, uh, so quarterfinals, and the Brian, Hill, Brian Hall Challenge Cup quarterfinals as well. So, next next game, uh, next episode, we will have three games from the league. And hopefully, hopefully by then, we'll have pretty much cemented our place at the top of the league and promotion to the next season. So, hopefully, we'll, we'll do that. And if you've enjoyed this game, I would appreciate a like, a comment, um, you know, a subscription if you've not subscribed already. It would really help the channel grow. And I'll see you guys next time.